first fit algorithm, we simply take each of the numbers in order and place them into the first bin that will fit, always going for the lowest number bin. So our first number is an 8, I'm going to cross that off and put that in the first bin. What I've written down to the right is the amount of space remaining in the bin. So at the moment we have 52 left in that one. Our next number, 16, well that can fit in the first one as well, that's absolutely fine. And now we've got 36 space remaining. We can fit the 12 in as well, which takes us down to 24. And we can fit the 8 in as well, and that takes us down to 16 remaining in that place. Now the 45 can't fit into this first one because we've only got 16 left. So that has to go into our second bin. And cross that one off. The 18 won't fit in the first as we only have 16 remaining. The second one only has 15 remaining. And so it must go into our third bin, which now has 42 remaining. And cross that one off. The 30 is our next one won't fit into the first, won't fit into the second, but it will fit into the third. So we now have 12 remaining in that space. And cross that one off. Seven. The seven will fit into this first one, so that is where we're going to put it. We put it in there. We now have nine remaining in that one. And cross off the seven. The 10, 10 won't fit in the first, we only have nine remaining. It'll fit into the second though, because we had 15. Now we only have five space remaining, so we can cross off the 10. The 14 can't fit in the first, can't fit in the second, can't fit in the third, so it goes into the fourth one, the first place that it can go. We now have 46 space remaining in that one. After the 14, we have a nine. Well, the nine can fit into the first one, and that first bin is actually empty. So we can cross off the nine. The second one, 9, won't fit into this second bin. We only have a space of 5 in there, but it will fit into the third bin. That now has a space of 3. So we can cross off the 9. And our last one, the 52, can't go in the first because it's full. Second one only has a space of 5. Third one has a space of 3. Can't quite fit into this fourth one. And so it must go into that fifth bin, leaving a space of 8. So we've only needed to use 5 bins. We must remember, place into the first bin each time that it fits. That's all you need to remember for the first fit algorithm.